So it's that time of year again when the board plans the major components of our next year of activities at Westwood. Our fiscal year ends on June 30th and we need to have our ducks in a row so that next year we can continue to provide for each other the best possible community in which to rest, grow and serve the world. It takes a lot of time, talent and treasure to operate a faith community, even a smaller one like Westwood. You see the evidence all around you. The time and effort that David puts in to provide a coffee and tea service faithfully each week. Yeah, sometimes he's late, but there's always coffee and tea. The talent that Rebecca brings to directing the Westwood Choir, Harmonia, and to leading the group of people who organize all our worship services. The treasure that we donate so that our building stays safe, clean, and warm, with lights on and water in the taps. And there are so many things that are invisible, like the time and effort put in by Dennis, Deb, and Larry to review the financial records of Westwood and provide suggestions for improvements if they see a need. Or like the hours that Lorian spends as our president enacting our vision of Westwood, organizing things, encouraging volunteers, writing letters, signing checks, filling out forms, and on it goes. In this room right now, there are more than one former president. You especially know what I'm talking about. I hope that each and every one of you find some time in the next few weeks to consider what being part of Westwood means to you. What has the Westwood community brought into your life? How can you be an active part of the life of Westwood? Our time, our talents, and our treasure are all finite resources. Last I checked, there are no billionaires among us with amazing talent and nothing to do. So, we all pitch in as we can. Some of us have more time than treasure. Others have more treasure than time. We all have talents of one sort or another. The result is a community of immense wealth. Each of us better for our association with Westwood and better able to do good in the world. I light our first stewardship candle this March full of gratitude for the wealth that this community has given me and with a desire to continue as an active member of Westwood in the ways that I'm able. <laughs>